Hello everyone, I am here with another video about Turkish aerospace projects. But first of all, please subscribe to the channel, it is free. After Boeing gave up on the purchase of Emirates Commercial Aviation Division, the market and government officials began to speculate about a possible negotiation between the Brazilian manufacturer and the Chinese company. Second largest aviation market in the world, China tries to sell a new model of commercial airplane but has faced technical difficulties. Embraer's knowledge could be a great ally to make the Chinese plane take off. On the other hand, experts in aviation sector estimate that Embraer could not be alone in the market. Since Airbus acquired Bombardier C-Series, the Brazilian manufacturer has gained a strong competitor. The partnership with Boeing was seen as inevitable to fight head-on with Airbus. Now, it would be necessary to look for a new partner. On 27 of April, President of Brazil, Jair Bolsonaro, even considered a new negotiation. Without mentioning which would be the commercial partner, code, we are evaluating it. It has a golden share. It is mine. I sign. If the deal is undone, perhaps a new negotiation with another company may be resumed. The new deal could be made with the Chinese manufacturer Comac. The company was created in 2008 to develop an airplane that could fight with the giants Boeing and Airbus, more specifically with the popular 737 and A320. Comac has been developing C919 for the past 12 years. The first prototype made its first test flight in May 2017, but there is still no prediction for it will be ready to fly commercial aviation. The C919 is an airplane with a capacity between 150 6 and 174 passengers and a range up to 5.5 thousand kilometers. These numbers are similar to the 737 and A320. However, the Chinese bet is on price. The C919 is expected to cost less than half the price of A320 or 737. The C919 has an estimated price of 50 million dollars, while the Airbus A320 is priced at $110 million, the Boeing 737 MAX 8 costs $120 million. The C919 has already received orders for 570 units. The vast majority of the orders came from the 23 airlines, which are Chinese state-owned companies. Outside of China, only the leasing company GE Capital Aviation and the Thai airline City Airways have also signed a contract for the new aircraft. The merge between Embraer and Comac could generate benefits for both companies. The Brazilian manufacturer can open its stores as a preferred partner in the Chinese market. At the same time, Comac can benefit from the knowledge and expertise of Brazilian engineers to solve the problems in the development of its aircraft.